Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News, RoverTreeHugger.com, and they're talking about what they call a simple new process that turns sewage sludge into biocrude oil. Sewage sludge is a byproduct of human waste. Yep, that's right, S stuff that goes into the sewer. But this process could also be applied to what's called wet feedstock or agricultural waste, plant stalks, wet grass clippings. Before, to make artificial oil, it would need to be dried first. But this process of creating this bio crude, not quite synthetic oil, is very energy intensive it looks like i'm not sure if it uses more energy than it creates my guess is it probably does maybe there are methods to use renewable energy but you got to get the the substance heated to 660 degrees fahrenheit and reach 3000 psi of pressure you'll need a powerful compressor to get that much pressure and you might be able to use the sun's energy and using mirrors to heat up to something that hot but I don't know. I'm a little skeptical about how much energy this could really produce, but I'm glad there are scientists working on it because it could be more efficient. They call it hydrothermal processing, I believe they call it. Yeah, hydrothermal processing. It's come a long way in the last 10 years, and it could become a great way to create artificial biofuels. If you'd like to read more about it, the link will be in the description, and if you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.